Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to a what I wore in a week video. Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So this is a what I wore in a week video. I adore filming these videos, they're so easy for me to film. Um, and it just means I get to show you so many outfits all in one go and because of the change in season We are finally in proper autumn outfits. I've done my wardrobe switch over so this is full-on Autumnness so coats jackets boots the whole lot. So I'm very very excited for this video So it's Monday today, and this is obviously the first outfit of the week But I want to start off by sharing some jewelry pieces um, that are new in with you guys Oh, you'll have to excuse the lighting the sun is just going in and out So it's making it a bit difficult if I flip you around like this I think it's a bit easier for you to see so all the jewelry that I am wearing today is from Ana Luisa And if you've watched my channel for a little while, you'll know all about Ana Luisa. I wear their jewelry all the time It's a beautiful ethical sustainable brand they make gorgeous elegant pieces that are so my style all the packaging is recyclable it's just a gorgeous gorgeous brand you can get 10% off I will put all the information in the description box for you guys but yeah let me show you my new in pieces so first of all I've got this gorgeous gorgeous necklace on it's stunning so simple it's just a little minimal thin gold chain and then this gorgeous kind of like point in the middle of it I just think it's stunning so simple really expensive looking it was so affordable as well so this necklace is called the Vida necklace kind of like a little V um, and it's just yeah absolutely gorgeous elegant and very much my style now next up I have on this beautiful bracelet I feel like my jewelry collection is very very short of bracelets and this one I just think is stunning as you can see it's gold with these gorgeous little almost flowers on it stunning just so beautiful again a really thin gold chain which i love this is called the rowena bracelet if i put it there in the sun you can just see how stunning it is gorgeous and you can have it on different settings as well there's three little hoops there that you can choose from depending on your wrist size and finally my favorite favorite piece this might even be the nicest piece of jewelry in my collection at the moment i adore this ring so this is called the chain ring which with a topaz in the middle of it gorgeous it looks like a diamond I just think it's absolutely stunning again so minimal I don't have anything like this and it's actually on a little chain there is a necklace as well that's very similar to this on the Ana Luisa website which I have definitely got my eye on but yeah I just think this is so understated so beautiful and it looks so expensive. So yeah, those are my gorgeous Ana Luisa bits of jewelry. Of course, they will all individually be linked in the description box. Don't forget you can get 10% off, which is a fab saving on these stunning bits of jewelry. I'll link the website as well so you can check new in as well if you wish. But yeah, onto the outfit now. So I am wearing, sorry about the lighting, the sun is just glaring straight through the window. Um, but I've got my new jacket on. So this is from Zara. Um, I've had it a couple of weeks now and I have just been wearing it non-stop. I love it. These kind of quilted jackets are so in at the moment. They're everywhere. And I love the colour of this one. I was umming and ahhing between getting this one and then a navy one from Arquette. I'm so glad I picked this green because it's so wearable. It's also reversible as well. So if you prefer like a shiny finish, um, you can kind of wear it inside out. It's from Zara, by the way. I don't know if I said that. Um, I got it in a size medium, so it's a little bit oversized, um, which I really, really love. And it was only £49.99 as well, which I know might seem a lot for quite a flimsy jacket, but I've not seen any of these kind of quilted jackets for that price. They were all kind of upwards of like £80, closer to £100. So I was very pleased when I found this one on the Zara website. Underneath it, I've just got on a plain black long sleeve bodysuit. I have loads of these from Zara. Um, I get them every single autumn and winter because they're so easy to wear such a great basic it's ribbed as well which is lovely but yeah i have this in a chocolate brown color as well then on my bottom half i am wearing just a pair of plain wide leg black trousers if i step back you might be able to see them a bit better yeah there you go these are from fourth and reckless they're so comfortable they're sold out at the moment though so i will link a similar pair down below but yeah i just love them so comfortable really chic really easy to wear 
um, and you can't go wrong, I don't think, with a pair of wide leg black trousers. Very easy to style with trainers, as I have done here. I've got my Axe Laragato ones on, but also you could quite easily dress these trousers up with a pair of heels and a blazer as well. Um, you will notice I've also got my belt on. This is my little YSL belt that I got from Farfetch. Absolutely love it. It's the thinner size, so it's nice and understated, but yeah, really love this. And then I've actually got my Polen paris bag today which i haven't used in ages but i adore this i can't remember which number it is but obviously it'll be linked down below it's in this gorgeous tan leather color which i adore it's such a beautiful shape and i just thought i haven't used this bag in the longest time I'm gonna give it the wear that it deserves. It's amazing quality, such a stunning shape. And I just thought it worked quite nicely with the khaki green. I really like these kind of earth tones to kind of break up an all black look, which is what I always tend to go for. If I'm struggling to know what to wear, I'll just put on all black, which sometimes is great, but I do think it's nice to experiment with a few more earthy kind of tones in the autumn. So that is what I've done here with the khaki and the tan leather. But yeah, this is the full outfit. So very, very comfortable, very easy, chic, kind of like an off-duty style look today that I've gone for. The sun is out, so I think I should be okay warmth-wise in this jacket, because it's quite thin. So in the winter, I will really layer up underneath something like this. But yeah, this is Monday's outfit. Hi, everyone. On Tuesday today, we've not got the glaring sun. Um, it's definitely a little bit cooler and a little bit more cloudy today, hence why I've got on a big old coat. So I know I said in yesterday's clip that um, I was trying to steer away from like all black outfits. There's an all black outfit. <laughs> I just love this coat so much and I think it does look really, really good with all black. Um, it's from Zara. It's a, I think it's called oversized wool coat. Um, and I'm wearing it in a size extra small, so it is a little bit oversized. I would say you definitely don't need to size up unless you want it really big. I quite like it like this. Um, excuse the olive tree, by the way. I was taking some pictures, so I've moved it out the way <laughs> and forgot to put it back. But underneath, I'm just wearing my Adenola crop top. I love these. Um, they don't actually do this shape anymore, which is slightly annoying, but I've linked the most similar one that I could find on their website. Obviously, it's still got all my Ana Luisa jewellery on. My trousers, you guys will have seen before. These are from Forth and Reckless. They are called the Caden Vegan Leather Trousers. Um, they are sold out, I think, in most sizes. I will still link them down below just in case, or you might be able to find them um, on Depop or eBay or somewhere else. Uh, but I literally adore these trousers they fit so nicely they're such a great leather so comfortable so soft and um, they do have a very similar pair currently on the website which are in stock so i've linked them down below as well and then i have my axe Regato trainers on again um these are just so comfy they're always my go-to and then i have my little ysl black bag as well this bag just gets used constantly i love it so much um this is the nano size by the way i've mentioned that quite a few times but in case you're unsure this is the nano um I do love it. I don't know if I wish I'd got the small or not. I feel like this is big enough for me. Um, I fit everything in it, but there are some times where I think, oh, just wish I could shove something extra in there because all of my bags are quite small. But yeah, I love it. It's the grainy leather. Um, I got it direct from the St. Laurent website. I will link the exact one down below. This is my miserable Tuesday outfit. Very comfy and casual, but the tailored structure of this coat makes it look a bit smarter, which I absolutely love. Hi everyone, Wednesday today and I'm in a trench coat. Again, it's quite a gloomy sort of day. Um, this trench coat I have a love-hate relationship with. Well, no, that's probably not the right term to use. Um, I did consider selling this trench coat um, a little while ago. I think I mentioned it in one of my videos. I just think I don't want to sell it until I can find the perfect trench coat and I've not yet found one. So I'm still wearing this until I can find one that I really, really love. I do like this trench coat. I like the colour of it. Um, I quite like the oversized fit. I just don't like the fit at the bottom. Like, it's huge. Um, but I am going to wear it today, even though I dislike it. Also, I really dislike how you can see this pocket, but... Anyway, um, until I find the perfect trench, I'm going to have to stick with this one. It's from H&M, by the way, but it's old. I got it last, I got it last spring. 
um, but I have linked two similar ones down below which I might actually try and get myself because they might fit a little bit better. This is a size extra small to small by the way, it's not even a big size. But anyway, um, I've got this black bodysuit on that I had on earlier in the week, it's just a long sleeved black ribbed body. I've then got on these leggings from Zara, these I got ages ago, they're called the Ottoman Zara leggings and they obviously just have this kind of split at the bottom which I love, I think it's really really cool. They're so comfy as well, they do come up a little bit small though, um, I'm wearing a size small I think but I kind of wish I'd got a medium just so I had a little bit extra room um, and a little bit extra length as well because I wanted them to be quite long because I've got them really like pulled down at the moment but anyway I'm talking about them like they're available they're not um, I don't know why because Zara had them on the website for literally like probably two years they were on there for ages and then all of a sudden um, they just took them off and they've only got them on the website in beige so I've linked the beige ones down below and I've also linked some from Topshop that are very very similar to these same kind of like split hem style but in black then I've obviously got on my Dior trainers which are looking a bit dirty I really need to get them cleaned and of course my YSL but I'm just popping out running errands today so I wanted to be really comfortable um, and I am and I think it looks like it's going to rain as well it looks really really miserable so perhaps the trench will be um, a good idea today so it's Thursday today and I'm just off on a very casual kind of walk slash coffee run type thing. So I've got a bit of active wear on today. So this grey set is from Adenola as most of my gym sets are. I love it. Such a nice kind of like charcoal colour. Really comfy. Um, the top and the leggings aren't exactly the same though. You can kind of see the top is a bit darker. Just slightly annoying. Oh well, what can you do? Then I've just popped on this American Vintage blazer over the top to kind of smarten it up a little bit. Make it look a little bit more... Um, chic rather than sporty. I've got my Adenola cap on as well. I love this one. It's got the green writing. Then just, um, I think this is just an ASOS sweatshirt over my shoulders because it is a little bit chilly outside. And then on my feet, I have my New Balance and these are the 990V5, a very complex name for a trainer. Um, I can't find these in stock in this colorway. Um, anywhere, literally anywhere online. So I've linked the black, but yeah, I will keep checking and I will let you guys know on Instagram if these come back into stock because they always sell out so fast. They're such nice trainers. But yeah, this is the full look. Um, I'm not sure what size I'm wearing this blazer in, but I will link it down below because it's super oversized. I really love the color of this blazer. I don't have one this color in my collection, so it's a nice addition. And I think it goes quite nicely with the gray kind of charcoal color. So this is my very casual third Thursday look. Excuse my hair by the way, I've literally done nothing with it all week so it's looking a little bit drab. Um, I'll try and fix that for tomorrow. So here we are, it's Friday, made it to the end of the week. Oh, the tracks are going past. Um, I'm off out for some dinner actually so I've got a bit of a jazzier outfit on. This is something that I wouldn't normally wear, um, let alone wear these two items together but the shirt and the trousers are from Georgina Lennon's collection with Forth and Reckless and I went to the launch a couple of weeks ago and she was wearing these two items together and I never would have thought that this shirt would have worked with these snakeskin trousers but I thought I'd give it a go and I really really love the two together so yeah shirt I'm wearing in a size 8 um, I probably could have sized up and trousers I'm also wearing in a size 8 and these fit really really nicely they're so comfortable um, I ate dinner in these before and yeah they were really comfy didn't dig in around my waist or anything and then my vest top is from Pretty Lavish it's just like a short sleeve vest top really comfy really nice and thick as well so it's got like a little bit of extra warmth and then my boots I literally adore these boots I wear them every single autumn winter they always come out again I've had them for I think about four years they're from Mango, but obviously they're old, so they're no longer in stock. But I found a really, really similar pair on ASOS, um, so I've linked them down below. But yeah, this is the full look, and here comes the rain. Uh, but yeah, I love it. Something very different for me. I really hope these pieces from Georgina Lennon's Fourth and Reckless collection are still in stock. Or there might be a restock, I don't know. I will try and keep you guys posted. But yeah, the pieces from Fourth and Reckless are incredible quality. I love them. This part of the video is not an ad or anything, by the way. 
I just love the brand. So yeah, they always sell out super fast because the pieces are so nice. Hi everyone, welcome to Saturday's outfit. Um, I feel like Maple was in the exact same position yesterday when I filmed this. Uh, but I'm in this gorgeous, gorgeous white coat that I received this week um, from Oasis. It was a PR product, so thank you very much, Oasis. I need to cut that tag hanging out. I must remember to do that before I leave. But I'm popping out for lunch today, and um, yeah, I wanted to dress up a bit, so I thought I'd wear this new coat. It is stunning. I love the shape of it. It's just, yeah, it's gorgeous. I wasn't expecting it to be as nice as it is. But yeah, I've just paired it with an all black outfit underneath. This bodysuit that I've worn about 10 times this week. It has been washed since the last wear, don't worry. Um, I've then got on a pair of leather shorts. Let me move this so you can see them a bit better. So these leather shorts I've had for a very long time. They're from Zara and I got them I think about two or three years ago. I love them. I love the deep pockets, the elasticated waist. Um, they've got big sort of like belt bow tie as well on them. Um, they're a really nice length as well. They're not too short, they're like a respectable length. So you, you could wear them without tights, but I just thought the Gucci tights looked quite nice with them. And then these boots that I've had for I think two years, maybe three, they're still in stock on Zara. Um, so I will link them down below, but they're so comfortable. They're just such a lovely boot. I'm so glad I bit the bullet and bought them. They are expensive. They are £120, but they're a beautiful boot. They're so classic, timeless, comfortable, you name it. The coat I'm wearing in a size small, I think. And yeah, I didn't need to size up. It's already a little bit oversized, so it fits really, really nicely. I am sorry that I have used this bag pretty much every day this week, but I just love it so much. It goes with everything. I say this in every what I wore in a week video, but it's just the perfect bag, so it gets used a lot. But yeah, I think this could be my favourite outfit of the week so far. Um, tomorrow will probably just be a very casual outfit as it's Sunday, so I will um, see you tomorrow. So it's Sunday today. We've reached the end of the week and I'm in some comfy loungewear today. Got this gorgeous set on from Warehouse. They very kindly sent it to me and I love it. It's so comfortable, really nice. Just these black ribbed trousers. They're super high waisted, come all the way up here. Um, really nice size though. They're a size small that I'm wearing. They're nice and roomy, loose fitting. Um, they're quite long as well, but I don't really mind that if I take my zippers off. Yeah, I don't mind that. If I was wearing them out, they'd probably get um, a bit dirty on the bottom, but just for around the house, they're fine. Um, and then obviously this cardigan with tortoiseshell buttons to match. Yeah, I love it, it's gorgeous. You can do it up. It was a bit tight at the bottom, so I thought it just looked better open. And then of course I have on my white company slippers. I literally live in these when I am at home, but I'm not going out to do anything because it's Sunday. It's a restful day. I'll just be spending it in the house. Um, so I'm in my comfy clothes. I also wear this kind of stuff um, when I'm working from home as well because it's just so easy to throw on and it's kind of like semi smart as well. But yeah, as it's Sunday, it's the end of the week. I'll be ending the video here. Don't forget to check out the Anna Louisa website. You can get 10% off. Um, as always, I will leave everything linked in the description box for you guys. I've literally worn this jewelry all week. I am obsessed. This ring is probably my favorite thing at the moment. I think it's stunning. Um, so I will link these individual items in the description box as well. If you enjoyed this video, it would be amazing if you could give it a like. And if you are new to my channel, I would love it if you subscribed. And I will see you all very soon with another video. Bye.